Get it. Let me redo that. Oh, Trey got him a good one. There we go, there we go, there's a fish, baby. Trey doesn't have a GoPro on. I should probably buy a new GoPro. Oh, let's go, Trey. Oh, let's go. Oh. What's up guys, it's TJ aka Fishing with Yak Pack and in today's video we are testing the most expensive baitcaster combo versus the cheapest baitcaster combo. Now the most expensive one is going to be the Lose Pro TI baitcaster and the rod. So the, the whole combo, right? The whole Pro TI combo. And then the cheapest one is going to be the $97 Lose Xfinity slash Walmart collaboration rod. Uh, you guys know that I'm a huge advocate of the Xfinity series. Not only because I, I feel like they're great quality for the amount of money that you spend, but that you, anybody can go pick them up at nearly any given Walmart in the country. And they're just one of the best budget friendly rods that you can possibly get. So to help me in today's video, Trey is here with me. Norm is actually at my house right now, right this second, editing a video. So uh, funny story, this is Norm's Pro TI rod and my Pro TI reel because I don't have the rod, and he, but he doesn't have the reel. So we kind of we kind of paired that up there. But uh, Trey's gonna be fishing that one. About halfway through the video or so, we're gonna switch. I'll be fishing the Xfinity about halfway through. We'll switch off. We're also gonna be using uh, some baits out of this month's Monster Bass box. We're gonna bust this open really quick. All right, let's go ahead and bust this box wide open. See what we got. All right, Monster Bass, Southern Region, October 2020, right? Yeah, we're in 2020, almost said 2019. Black and Blue Thunder Cricket. Uh, no words need to be spoken about that. You can't, you can't beat that. We look at this ugly mug right here. We got a wild Alex Rudd sticker. Really cool looking sticker. We got some weird, crazy looking hooks. A, uh, this is probably not gonna make it. Two and a half. Diving depth, four to eight feet. That might not be bad, actually, Trey. That might not be bad. A Monster Bass exclusive. Oh, Rick told me about these. I don't think these actually come out for individual sale until 2021. I think April 2021, something like that. But really cool color. So hopefully that can catch us some big fish. We got some really salty boy looking Senkos right there. Jerk bait, I'm just low key guys, not a huge jerk bait fan. Some swim baits right there, that actually might get munched because this looks like and replicates a Mayan cichlid and we have those down here in South Florida and the bass like to eat those. So uh, that, that red color right there, that fiery red color, really good color. Also, buzzing warmouth rig T side. It even tells you how to rig it. Instructions for people and fishermen like me who need help figuring out how to rig these up properly. But that looks pretty cool, what else we got? I think that's all we've got in this box. We've got this cool little book right here. It tells you how much the box is worth. I'll put a little stamp up on the screen to show you guys how much all this bait right here is actually worth. Also guys, while I pack this up, another very exciting announcement I have. The official Fishing with Yak Pack merch is live right now as we speak. And for the next 30 minutes, there's an active discount code of 20%. So anything, whatever you buy, you're gonna get 20% off for the next 30 minutes. So you still got plenty of time uh, if you want to wait until this video is over and you want to go check the website out. But it's fishingwithyakpack.com. It's popping up right here on the screen and it'll be the very first link down in the description. I've, uh, I've been working tirelessly for probably six weeks now. I would not have been able to do any of the stuff that I'm doing right now if it were not for you guys. That's why I wanted to do the uh, the 20% off discount for the first 30 minutes that the site is live. So with all that said, if you guys wanna go check the website out, if you do get something, thank you dearly from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much. Uh, if you don't, you just wanna go kinda check it out, snoop around and see how cool it looks and all that good stuff, you're more than welcome to do that as well. Again, it's fishingwithyakpack.com. Be the first link down in the description. I actually have one of the shirts right here on. There's multiple colors of multiple different designs. Uh, I have a lot more of stuff that I've ordered uh, like duplicates and replicas of uh, that I want to actually like in the future and very near future upcoming videos I want to like sign some shirts and stuff like this or some hoodies Especially because it's about to be winter time for most everyone except for South Floridians uh, I want to sign some stuff and send it off to you guys for like some little appreciation type giveaway stuff on the website You're gonna find that I've got hats shirts hoodies stickers uh, a couple pairs of shorts and some joggers with all that being said now that we've got all the uh, the goods mentioned we are now going to start lining up some of our rods this one actually this is crazy i've got this lined up from uh, a video that a lot of you have probably seen it's the yarn on a bait caster challenge and let me just tell you this was a lot harder than it seemed and by a lot harder i mean not like one to ten number seven harder i mean like one to ten like 25 harder this was absolutely crazy if you guys want to see that it's up on the channel <laughs> feel free to go watch it but look at this beauty We've got the Pro TI combo. Oh man, that is some sauce. And then we've got the Walmart Xfinity combo. That 
It's some good looking combos right there. Are you ready to uh, to catch some fish? Yes. I'm just gonna yank this stuff off, dude. Holy smokes. Man, we should be good to go. Got the, let's see. That's not gonna be able to come off, is it? Yeah, it is. Oh, it's okay. I'm gonna show you guys the equivalent of what this line was before we actually get started fishing. Cause I still gotta put some line. All right, let me see. That's 50 pound. Hold that out like that. That's 50 pound braid versus, I don't know what the equivalent would be. That's like 1000 pound braid, no joke. Holy, I didn't realize it was like that thick. That's crazy. This like fin versus, that's insane. I've got to admit the, uh, the black line going on this white and orange fishing reel. It gives it a very nice Halloween theme. Well, go pitch, because I'm pitching to it. There we go, baby. That's a good fish, too. <sighs> move, move your line, Trey. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Move, 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 move. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that's a tank. That is a tank. <laughs> get him up, get him up, get him up. <laughs> there wasn't any fish in here? Dude, Yak Pack's first time out here fishing, dude. Holy cow. Oh, he stinks. That's uh, easy five and a half, probably, maybe. Oh, uh, you know, that might be a little bigger than five and a half. That's like YouTube eight, baybaby. <laughs> <laughs> Holy. Eight, baby. Oh my gosh, Yak Pack. What? Let's free, oh, yeah. oh, dude, just like this. Holy Let me turn my cow, dude. Out. Yeah. Yak back, you done did it, bro. This makes no <laughs> sense to me. Oh whatsoever. my gosh. Let's get some pictures and get him back. Oh my gosh. All right, ladies and gents, this is a, a, a certified, certified eight pounder. We put him on the scale. Out, no, I'm just kidding. He's probably, what do you think? Like almost six, maybe? Yeah, probably. He's pushing six. Yeah. I'd say 5.873 <laughs> all day long. Awesome, beautiful fish, though. I got to be very careful here in Florida. You don't want to, uh, Get too crazy with the water there's alligators in here oh yeah oh yeah let's go bro that was uh that was quite the catch not expecting that you know sometimes being this good oh painful, here we go you know? here we go it's painful. <laughs> uh, I, you know i'll wake up in the morning i eat excellence for breakfast and i'll just try to tell these boys 50 pound braid and a 20 pound leader that's all you need when you're out here pond fishing I'd have caught that fish if I was Trey. I'm, Honestly, I mean, I probably would have. the three quarter ounce. Barrel <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. That was an awesome fish catch, though. That was insane. When you started reeling them in, I was like, oh, okay. And then he went back the other way, and I was like, uh oh. Yeah, and then I tightened my drag all the way up, and then like he kind of, it was like, Zzz. I was like, oh, that's that's a big one. That is yeah. That's that awesome. Hey, congrats, dude. Yeah, dude. That's awesome. All right, Trey's gonna start out with a thunder cricket. I'm gonna start out throwing the uh, the little Senkos right here. That way we're fishing kind of like two separate separate little things let's see what else we got crankbait we'll give that a shot we'll give it a shot this one uh, it's it's 104 degrees nothing's eating top water right this minute maybe later this evening but definitely not right now so we're gonna put these in our bag and carry them with us we're probably gonna try to not throw them all right i think we're ready let's get to fishing all right guys before we get started fishing go ahead and drop your comments down in the comment section which combo do you think is going to catch the bigger fish today do you think it's going to be the uh i think that's like 700 bucks yeah that's yeah it's like close. 7 750 and this one's 97. which one do you think is going to catch the biggest fish all right you get ready let's do it touch tips let's go let's go i gotta stick kind of close to trey because trey doesn't have a gopro on i should probably buy a new gopro oh let's go trey let's go trey's hooked up let's go trey on the first one first fish of the day let's go dude first fish of the day that's a good one on the 700 hundred dollar combo there we go dude let's look at that on the 700 hundred dollar combo slime looks like you know oh, oh okay now you gonna put slime on we've been here we've been here for six minutes and yeah. you're gonna catch one fish okay yeah. all right bet watch i'm gonna catch a nine pounder today dude first fish of the day all right so that means that means you get front of the boat Oh, Trey got him a good one. Trey got him a good one. Look at that. Water skiing these fish because it's so hot out here, man. Let's go, dude. Are we up? You're, I think you're up. That's a uh, 2 0. I think you're up 2 0. You have to step your game up. Uh, yeah, you two, you telling. Holy smokes. All right, that's what we're going to do. Trey's up on us 2 0. 
there's this grass line right here. I'm gonna make a bomb cast down the, I'm calling it now, bomb cast. I might stand here and cast probably 10 times, but it's all right. Oh, let's go on the grass line. On the, right on the grass line, Trey. I told you. Right there. Where I told you you would be. Let's go. Oh, he's digging. Oh, look at that, dude. Look at that fish. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. Right here in the grass line, baby. There you go. Two to one. Two to one. All right, you better. All right, I don't call it a comeback. I'm coming in hot. Nice fish. Look, there's a, uh, you guys can probably see it on the GoPro. Let's go ahead and get the zoo back because it's really hot. But you guys can probably see there's a grass line right here and it goes out at like an angle kind of like that. And I was running that Senko through that grass line, like on the, the right side, the deeper side of it. Smoked it. Oh, what? Yo, I just threw mine back and just re-rigged. I thought I was coming back. It was, it was two to one. Now it's three to one. Oh no! You know what you need? You need one of those major league pond hopper hoodies. That's what you need. That's what you need. Hey, good thing. Hey, good thing. Fishing with Major league pond hopper hoodies for sale right now. Let me see. Let me get it closer because I know you ain't got to go, Prawn. Show them the dude. Third. That's the best fish of the day, hands down. That's a chunky boy. Yes, right there. sir. Good hey, fish. look at that monster bass thunder cricket right there in the hey, dome. The monster bass thunder cricket do be smacking them though. I'm just saying. I'm Same. just saying. Just saying, I'm getting outfished right now on my home turf. I don't know how I feel about that. I do just need to get better. Look, guys, this is—I don't know if you guys can see that. Right here in the water, these little bluegill are cruising this grass line, and I think that's probably why I got munched on the senko down there, and that's also probably why Trey is just absolutely crushing the fish right now because these bait fish are moving. They're eating moving baits. So I'm gonna—you know what? I've already caught one on the senko. I'm gonna I'm gonna switch it up to that crankbait. We're gonna give that a shot. Yo, I'm just saying this thing do be looking soft though. All right, ladies and gents, it has been roughly uh, 25 to 30 minutes, give or take, and I haven't even had a single bite on this. I actually did have two followers, but they were two little cichlids and uh, and not bass. So I'm gonna try to switch it up. So what you think about a 7-Eleven fountain drink? There ain't no 7-Eleven near here, bro. There's a racetrack down the road. Ooh, that should be the move. Hey. All right, listen. Here we go. If by the end of this fishing adventure, you have more fish than me, I will go get us racetrack fountain drinks on me. And slushies. Extra you large do. ones. And at slushies, that. you got to do it. And slush. Ooh. All right, deal. I bet. I don't think you need a trailer. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Look at that, Trey. The finesse chatter bait. <laughs> the finesse thunder cricket, baby. Let's go. Let's get it. Hey, dude. Dude. That hook set was vicious, by the way. Oh, I got the best hook set. I'm just East saying. Mississippi, I'm just saying. Look, anyway, that's a four to uh, what? One? Four to one, yeah. I thought he was going to say a four pounder. I was like, yeah, I could be a YouTube four pounder all day. Like that right there. There you go. That's YouTube sure. four, baby. We win in tournaments with that one. Oh, and he's an acrobat. Look at that. Want to see me again? That was sick. There we go. There we go. There's a fish, baby. Let's go. Swim in the speed worm. Ah, sucker. Don't call it a comeback. Oh my gosh, dude. This guy is a wild child. This guy munched it. All right. Two on the Xfinity, four on the Pro TI. Don't call it a comeback. Four to two. We might have to go to <laughs> racetrack. Might be on me. <laughs> it might be on me. All right, guys, check it out. Trey and I are now going to have a casting competition. Okay, so we're just going to go stand in this parking lot right here. We're going to cast my rod as far as I can, set the croc down, one of my crocs. We're going to set that down where it lands, come back, cast his rod, and then go see where exactly it lands. We were going to do this in the water, but I started thinking just now, like, we wouldn't really actually be able to accurately tell how far we made it. So, Let's move over here to the uh, the parking lot. The reason we're doing this right now is because the fish absolutely just shut down and it's 112 degrees as you can see from the stain on my shirt. <laughs> I'm about to die sweating, so let's go see. Who do you think is gonna win? Uh, me. You me think too. so? Yeah. Mm, drop those comments, guys, before we even get started. Drop those comments. All right, guys, up first, lose Xfinity. Walmart combo, $97. Here we go. He's taking this dub. Let's get it. 
Let me redo that. Take two. All right. Actually, come to think of it, guys, I don't know what I'm thinking. See, it's that hot out here. It's got my mind all kind of confused. I don't need to go out there and put my Crocs out there. We could just leave my, my rod on the ground. As simple as that. All right, you ready? Yep, let's do it. Take one for him. It took me two tries. <laughs> How far? Yeah, I got you. Let's go see. So my Senko is there. Let's go. About eight more yards. Is it worth $700 for eight more yards? He's fishing a half ounce Thunder Cricket and I was fishing a 3 16 ounce Speedworm. So I feel like no matter what weight ratio you go, you're probably still gonna get a little bit further of a cast with a $700 combo. That's just. I mean, that just is what it is, but let's not speed past the fact, okay? We do this thing in the army called hunt the good stuff, right? A $97 combo from Walmart still got right up there with a $700, $750 combo. That is insane. But let me just point this out to you guys really quick. This uh, big giant hurricane category 12 storm coming in right here. We need to get back to the truck before that gets here. And that's coming in very fast. So Trey, let's reel these up and uh, we'll see you guys back at the truck. All right, guys, we just got back to the truck and uh, come to think about it, Trey and I never switched because we got to talking about, well, we got to talking smack to each other, number one, about the uh, the casting competition. And we also got to talking about why the fish just kind of shut down and uh, and stopped biting. So for the past like five minutes or so, I've been like taking care of like the thumbnail stuff and, and all that other good stuff. So for Trey's been fishing with this for like five minutes now, but what do you think about the $97? I know you don't have much experience. So my thing is, I have a lot of experience fishing this. Trey, on the other hand, does not have that much experience fishing with the Walmart Xfinity series. So what do you think about the uh, the combo in your 10 minutes, give or take, of using it? I really like it, especially for the budget angler. It's very sensitive, pretty light in the hand. It casts smooth, and I'm actually personally missing about three or four combos in my own collection. I think I might add a couple of these to my own personal collection. Ooh, you know what the deal is. No, they are really nice though. For 97 bucks, uh, you can't beat it here on this channel. You will always see and hear me. Now, don't get me wrong. Hold this real quick for me, Trey. Don't get me wrong, guys. This right here, studly. This is an absolute phenomenal combo if you have $700 to spare on fishing gear. If you do not, and you're an everyday budget angler like myself, like Trey, like many, like 99.9% .9 of you probably watching this, this Xfinity combo, can't beat it, can't beat it. Trey beat me today, he did catch more fish than me, but that's okay, that's okay. It was just, you know, sometimes good fishermen, great fishermen, uh, God tier fishermen have their off days. And that's just, <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. Anyways, I hope y'all enjoyed watching. Don't forget, fishingwithyakpack.com. Go scoop the merch. It's not just merch, guys. It's a movement. It's a whole movement. The Positive Vibes movement. Are you ready? Uh, I don't know why I just gave you the rods, but all right. Are you ready? We're, we're trying to beat this. There, where's the storm? There's a storm right there, and we're trying to beat that. Love you guys. Thanks again for watching. We'll catch you on the next adventure. Peace. Good framing right there. Yeah, pretty good. All right, guys, check it out. That's going to... Uh, uh,